Hi friends, today I am going to Silver City, New Mexico with my mom and one of my sisters and I thought I would shoot a short bonus video for you because Silver City is such a beautiful place yet not too many people know about it. It's a mining town located in southwestern New Mexico and it's surrounded by mountains and trees and lakes. So if you like the outdoors, you will absolutely love it. But right now I'm just waiting for my mom to get her things so we can load up the car and get driving. I've been coming to Silver City my whole life because my mother was born about 15 miles from here, but I'll tell you more about that later. First, I want to show you Silver City and the historic downtown area. The architecture of the buildings is really cool and there's lots of fun shops all within walking distance of each other. One of my favorite places to eat while here is Jalisco Cafe. They serve great Mexican food and you can't go wrong with anything on the menu. In recent years, Silver City has become known as an artist community, which you'll definitely get a sense of when you drive around. But it's also known as the gateway to the Gila cliff dwellings, where you can hike up to these ancient caves where the Mogollon people built rooms and lived in the 1200s. This is video from when we visited a few years ago, and it was just so fascinating to see in person. But back to Silver City, today's visit is kind of bittersweet because my oldest sister has lived here her entire adult life until now. She just moved back to Southern New Mexico to be closer to the family. So we're all very happy about that. But at the same time, that also means we'll no longer have a reason to come out to Silver City. So we came out here to uh, help my sister do a little packing. And uh, I brought my camera so that I could help take pictures of her house so that she and her husband can list it. So we brought my mom because she wants to visit where she was born one last time. I mentioned earlier she was born not far from Silver City in a town that no longer exists called Santa Rita. And the reason it no longer exists is because it was literally blasted and hauled away in open pit copper mining. This pit is almost two miles wide and more than 1,300 feet deep. So my mom loves to tell people about the very exclusive club that she belongs to. Where the people that were born here, they called it a uh, born in space. And it's fitting because there's nothing but space where the town used to be. There's nothing anymore. There used to be a hospital, company store, hotels, tortillerias, there was a, it was a big place, big hospital. That's where I was born. It's, it's all changed. My grandfather worked in that mine and he was even awarded for coming up with a suggestion that apparently saved the mine a substantial amount of money over the years. So you can just see how this whole area is special to my family. But change is a part of life, and when one chapter comes to an end, another one begins, and you just gotta embrace it. Anyway, I now need to hit the road and get going home, but I hope you enjoyed this bonus video. Be sure to check back on Saturday. I thought I'd share a recipe where we can put some hatch green chili to use because I know that it is hatch chili season. Anyway, we'll see you then. 